was planning for Moxan's birthday! And let me tell you, it's gonna be great! What will Moxan think? We'll find out! Enjoy! Using the elevator is a much preferable option. Might as well look what's in there. Oh! I didn't know you guys were planning this. I was sensing something was happening, but I didn't expect this. Hey, we can't just leave you hanging. I know you're gonna be 13 this year. You are close to high school age. I'm also surprised that Yolin and Kazuko joined as well. We only known each other for only a week. Uh-huh. Well... <laughs> Look, Moxie, you saved our asses from the face of demise. You mean the store manager? Same thing. Point is, we owe you big time. Yeah, it's another one of our ways of saying thank you. Oh, well, you two are very generous. I really appreciate it. I'm glad you do. Who's up for the party? Me, I am. <laughs> Well, I guess I should join in on the fun as well. And so everyone partied on. Thankfully, there's no alcohol involved since Joden forbid anyone from drinking it. Later on, it was time for Moxanne to blow the candles and make her wish. So Moxanne, what'd you wish for? Come on, bro, she can't tell us. I wish for... Mom and Dad to improve on their social skills. As well as me keeping the friends I do have and making more in the future. Well, I made my wish. Let's dig in on the cake. Aw, cake! The mambo cake! Right? Right? You ruined it. You ruined it, and I am just gonna give Moxan her presents. You sure about that? I am damn sure. I wonder who this is from. Oh yeah, one of our cousins, Himeo, decided to chime in and give you something. Oh? What did he say exactly? That you're one of the only people in this part of the family he has respect for. <laughs> That's exactly what I said. Yeah, I'm starting to notice a pattern. Yeah, same here. Even I'm noticing the pattern. Well, in any case, I might as well open this. Holy crap! What is that? Well, it doesn't seem to harm Moxan, which is good. I, I don't want her to get hurt. Oh, hello. You seem harmless. I'm looking at the note in the box. This seems to be that Himeo gave you a companion float person thing. Oh, you mean a pyramidy? A uh, what? Yeah. A pyramidy is a miniature being that was made from one person's dream, when they are asleep. They can range from being pure to being deadly. How the hell does that even work? Well, pyramidies originate from a special gem, which is the star stone. A star stone has to be at least a close proximity of the person having their birthday. Within an hour, usually. How do you know this stuff? Like, what? I've studied this stuff when I was 11 years old. I chose to study it. Before then, I was a little envious of Hamio because he had one as well. That is, until I know how these things work. Especially given how star stones were extremely hard to find back then. Bingo! So what are you gonna name yours? Yeah, I'm actually pretty curious myself. Let's see. I guess I can name this little one. Previous. <laughs> Yay! 
Talavico. Yes, Kai? You owe the perfect hair after this. <laughs> hey, anything for you, princess. Better to do this than deal with what all Lady Loliendo will do. 